In the meantime, guys, let's go play Schools. This is by request for... Who requested this? Adeldrell requested this game. Let's go see what I can do with the Schools. I have not played Schools in a while. I know, Zarovich. We've, we've, we've talked about that a little... Actually, we didn't really talk about it. Chat was talking about it. But the B5 reboot is something that... I'm not going to lie. I'm a little skeptical of. Um, I... One of the if you if you guys follow me on Twitter, you know I had a brief exchange with uh, JMS himself after all this was announced, and one of the questions I asked well the the actually the only question I really asked him was he said for years right if you if you follow JMS on Twitter he said people have asked him for years you know why can't we get B five remastered why is B five not on Blu ray why have there has there been nothing else done with the property and he said for a very long time that um, uh, there was basically somebody at Warner Brothers who either hated him, hated Babylon 5, something, and they basically were like, no, no one will touch this. It, 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 will, it will die. Basically, they had decreed, this is a dead thing. We, no one's allowed to touch it. Um, and so I asked him, with after about a day after the reboot, the, the news broke, I said, um, I sent him a tweet, and I said, so you've said this before, the whole story about the, the you know, the, uh, the guy who's out to get you, whoever it is. Um, has that situation, like, resolved itself? Now, I didn't ask him, is this person still with the company or whatever? And basically what he said, he just came back and he said, yes, that situation is over, and so now we're allowed to move forward and do more things with B5. Okay. Um, but I am... I'm still a little skeptical, right? I, 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 trust, I trust J. Michael Straczynski. The man is a fabulous storyteller. Only a fool would not trust him to tell a good story. But B5... Right? B5 is so beloved and so good, right? At what it is, what it has been all these years. I I am I have I still have concerns, right? I still have concerns. Um I mean, Hetman makes a good point, right? If you if you go back and you watch Star Wars, the original cut of Star Wars circa 1977, you think, "Oh yeah, Lucas is really good at his job." And then they let him come back and play with it 20 years later. And boy, wasn't that a mistake, right? So, you know what I'm saying? I, 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 I legitimately believe JMS to be far better writer than George Lucas. So don't, don't take that as a direct analogy. My point is there's a risk, right? There's a risk there. You can't, you can't take away what we already have, okay? The B5, it, it, at, 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 at worst, you, you make something that's not, not as good or not very good. That's the worst that can happen. And you just go, eh, whatever. Like, life goes on. The B5 we have now, we'll always have. Like, that won't go anywhere. They can't take that away from us. But it does make me legit wonder. I, I, I still have some concerns, right? I am, I am definitely a little concerned about, about what that's going to look like and where that might go. Just because I, um, I don't know. There's so many, so many fabulous things about Babylon 5. That to me, it is, it is almost, you, you certainly can't recreate it. You certainly can't, um, you certainly cannot replace some of those actors. Um, the actors are just stunningly good. The scripts and the story are stunningly good. So, yeah, like, I have, I have concerns, but we just have to wait and see, right? Whoever this destroyer is has got to be pissed at me. It's the Shinonome. He's finally going to get the cap. Well, you have to remember, Badger, that... Oh, hi, Ognaboy. You have to remember, Badger, that the... Um, the fifth season of B5, as we know it, kind of wasn't meant to happen in the form that we got it in, right? It was uh, a little bit of an oddball because of how things went with TNT. There's the Shinonome.
Why is the Massachusetts firing HE at me? That feels like a bad idea. There we go. Beat up the lolly boats. That is my job. Spot the lolly boats so I can beat them up. Ooh, double fire. He's going to feel that in the morning. <laughs> it's my Walter laugh. Uh, they filmed the season finale at the end of season four because when they when they signed off for season four, they believed the um, the season <laughs> they believed the season to be over. <laughs> that Shinonomi is pissed at me. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Okay, I gotta get out of here without losing my ship. Let's see if I can pull this off. <laughs> it's going to be exciting. Am I still lit? Yeah, the Ognaboy's got me lit. Yeah, my life. I'm about to get slapped off the board. So I might as, I might as well make this Ognaboy's life hell. I have to make this turn. I'm about to get I'm about to get absolutely gutted here. Yeah, there went, there went half my HP. There's not much I can do about that. It's got to happen. Time to go. McKinsey's not even looking at me? Wow. Okay. Sure, I'll take a little bit of this action. What's my base detection? It's high, I know that. Well, we're up a couple of ships, so I don't feel so bad. I shouldn't have probably pushed in quite so far down there. That's a little that's a little bit of a bad on my on my part. I gave up a whole nice Selavath. Nice. So, one of our CC crates has a tonight has awarded to Massachusetts. That's a good call. That's a good that's a good gig. Oh, hello. All right, let's beat up Let's get in a gunfight with the McKinsey. What could possibly go wrong? Well, what could possibly go wrong, ladies and gentlemen? Whoa, thank you for the follow. I've just maximized my adrenaline rush, guys. That's what this that's what that was all about. It's just about maximizing my adrenaline rush. To Jurassic Park. We've had Oigans, Alabamas. I had a guy win a Gasconia not, not too long ago. Um, so yeah, the CC crates can absolutely award nice ships. So congratulations. Glad you were able to benefit from that. That's awesome. Overshooting that guy just a bit. All right. Massachusetts is out. Life feels a little better right now. Kenson's not as fast as I expect him to be. Finally, finally got that guy to light. All right, we're going to get him one more salvo, then we're swapping to the Ognaboy. Oh, of course, now I can't see the Ognaboy anymore. Figures. Oh, killed another ship. All right, I'm in. Oh, oh yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. All right, let's pick on the Gnice. Or the Massa. Massa? Let's pick on the Massa. Not even I'm le I feel like I'm over leading him, leading him and I'm still behind him just a little bit. Okay, now that he has anything to shoot at, I'm going to draw his attention. So let's um Oh, double fire. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I 
Let's uh, let's 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 stop shooting. In the hopes that the massa will not notice me, I don't want to be noticed by Senpai. Okay, there we go. He's still burning. Now he put him out. Bummer. Good night, Teal. Thanks for being here, buddy. Hetman, the the you know the um, Blade Runner twenty forty nine. I, I it's not a bad film, but it's not a great one. I think I think the only the, the the kind of disappointment there is that you just expected more, right? And you didn't get it. Um, Villa de Wave, however you say his name, I'm sure I'm mispronouncing it. He's an excellent director. The man directed Arrival. Arrival is one of the best science fiction films Hollywood's ever turned out, right? Um, but I don't dislike 2049. I just think it could have been better. This Massachusetts is about to have his way with me, I fear. No, the Ganice is going to have his way with me. No, nope, they're all going to have their way with me. Woo! Look at that. I really did sell my soul to the devil. <laughs> See if the Belfast gets gets his shot in. Welcome. Massa missed. To Jurassic. Belfast caught me, but I'm still alive. Still alive. <laughs> PJ, um, it comes out tomorrow, actually. I, there's probably midnight showings tonight. I'm planning on going on Monday. Um, I was talking to my dad and a buddy of mine. Um, I mean, my father's the one who got me hooked on science fiction when I was growing up, right? So, I mean, my mom's not going to go see Dune with him. So we were, we were chatting about it, and, and we're going to go see it early next week. All right, we've got a three-ship lead, but our health lead is somewhat tenuous, to say the least. Sashio got a nice hit on the Massa. I really want to be farther away from this guy before I before I engage him. He must be the, the Sashio's radar. I'm kind of waiting. Oh, I think he's going to turn into one of those. Is he taking one of those? Oh, take one of those. Take one of those torpedoes. Dang it, they missed. I think he's going to land one on the Gnice. Yeah, the Gnice is going to take one of midships. Nice hit. My problem is I do not want to be... I don't want to have two battleships picking... I don't want to pick a fight with two different battleships. If I got one battleship shooting at me, I can play goofy games, but two is... Especially if I, you know, I'm, I'm literally like a one one to two full... Penet I'm like a one full penetration and I'm a dead, I'm a dead ship. So I do not want to risk that. Plus, their board position is really bad. Now, the Ganeisen, now on the other hand, is behind smoke. And the Massa has no shot. The Massa will have a shot by the time I can see him, but it is what it is. Richie's out. Ooh, things are getting dicey. I'd be shooting the Ganice right now if my spotter plane were up, but it isn't. Dang it. All right, Massa just shot. I need to get this guy to light. Yeah, he's going to shoot at me now. I can't even take one of these torpedoes or I'm dead. I think I got the plane. Woo! And I dodged all the Massachusetts shells? Almost all the Massachusetts shells. He got an overpen. Oh, 
Oh, why can't I get a fire on this dude? You're killing me, man. I'm about to die. Yep. Full pin right through me. Only got to hit me with one. I really wanted to get that fire. Oh, well. Bummer. Thank you, Sean. Appreciate you. Scores is a pretty good little ship, honestly. The the range is what makes her amazing, right? And they're buffing her range again soon, if I remember if I remember the dev, the patch the patch notes correctly. <laughs> Flipper. I mean, look, when you've only got three two thousand HP in a in a Scores and you're fighting a Massachusetts, that only ends one way, sir. Sarvich, <laughs> uh, it's a Russian light cruiser. They all turn like barges. That's just the way it goes. Kill the Massa, though. We have this game in the bag, and honestly. He should be dead right here. This Ryujo Torp should kill him. Bloop. There it is. Bloop. There it is. A good win. I do I do legit feel bad for the Shinonomi, though. I kind of molested that guy, and I had some really good RNG. <laughs> some really good RNG with the double fire. That was ridiculous. Excellent. Classic says we got all the codes out the door. That's what I want to hear. Thank you for that. All right. You know what? Hetman has reminded me that I can play Kearsage, so why don't we go do that? Top XP? Really? It didn't feel like it was that impactful of a game. Huh. Welcome. Okay. To Jurassic Park. Trekker! Thank you for the follow. Paladin. Dingling. 501st. Guys, thank you for the follow. Sorry I was zoned in, not really paying attention. Apologies. Thank you for all the follows. Nah, she really can't, Wellington. The, the, the thing about scores is you're still dealing with Russian light cruiser guns. Or Russian cruiser guns in general. They're good guns. It's the hull you're, you're constantly fighting. She's a light cruiser. She's not armored very well. She has great range, right? She's got, like, York range with rail guns that hit pretty good. But you take damage like nobody's business, right? I'm lucky I didn't get slapped off the board. I took that, what, that 20,000 hit from the, the Massa earlier. I'm lucky I didn't just get deleted, right? Because I, I probably, I, I should, by all rights, I should have just gotten deleted right there. 